we human beings are a fascinating, incredible species. We need to give a thing a name so that we can identify it. And as we know, there are infinite things in this incredible universe that we reside in. Our minds can only focus on one thing at a time, which does not mean that the other things do not exist or are not possible. And this causes a lot of our dilemmas that we experience in the world today, as we are not able to see and experience the whole landscape and picture and all the possibilities available. Now, humans experience life through our senses. And our state of being and our level of consciousness influences what we see and perceive. And most of our perceptions we inherited or have been conditioned to believe or have taken on from others, such as our worldviews, how we see ourselves and others, and how we think and feel about others, which all impact how we show up in the world, what and how we contribute, how we relate, engage and belong, and most of all, how we co-create and respond to and approach life and the world. And many has been conditioned to identify with their perceptions, which cause a lot of havoc. In a bunch of deaf nuisances, yes, definitions, we explore how these definitions keep us hostage and limit and impact our experiences, relationships and contributions to life. How they seduce us away from our own authentic true self and the possibilities available in each moment. And how they impact the many dilemmas we have in the world today, the workplace, society, family structures and personal relationships. In this embodied exploration, we get the opportunity to expand our own vantage point, to see with fresh new eyes, and to have more compassion and, and understanding for the viewpoints of others, which directly impacts our ability to thrive, all our thought processes, our emotions, feelings, and sense of self, bringing about peace, harmony, understanding, acceptance, and abundance and joy for all. <laughs>